Bam, welcome. Uh, it's Tabs. Uh, we've got some more goofy units, and let's kind of like see how they how they pan out. So there's a weird Renaissance faction. Uh, there are painters. Perfect. They have tiny little forks, and oh, I guess that's that sort of like palette. Okay, these guys look like a ragtag group of badasses. Not entirely sure what painters do. Let's throw them down against some clubbers. Uh, the clubbers are outpointed here. But. Oh wow, painters. Pretty stabby with those little forks. Not a single one died. Yeesh. Okay, right. Maybe, maybe too many painters. Oh, muskets. What's a musket gonna do? Let's test them out against someone that can probably tank a few musket shots. Okay, they feel a lot like archers. Uh, I guess they've got kind of fancier hats. They do not fire very quickly. Right, muskets not blown away by your work so far. Kind of just like junk. It's nice that they move backwards. That's kind of fun. Hmm, muskets. Not the best. What about balloon archers? What are these guys going to do? Okay, they're firework archers. Great. Not super effective. Okay, good job, guys. Great. Great work. What a fucking piece of shit that was. Okay, now we have fences. Uh, wow, fences. Pretty expensive. Are they basically just... Oh, jeez. How about ears? Are they just kind of like Valkyries? They are not really doing well against the halberdiers. Man, these halberdiers look amazing. Do they just have like a thinner version of the Executioner's Axe? I'm kind of into that. Wow, they've really pulled apart these fences. Yikes. Uh, right. What about the Da Vinci tank? What even, what even are you? That definitely is not a tank. Um, oh, okay, he's kind of fun. Pretty, pretty smashy. Throws a lot of stuff. Uh, he's kind of a bit like stuck. Ooh, wow. Okay, he's kind of blasting them. He's just in the, the maelstrom now. I don't know if he can pull this off. How tough is he? Can we possess him? Oh my god, we can. Oh, we died. What is this? What? Okay, sure. Uh, Super Peasant versus the Monkey Men. Super Peasant's a real glowy boy. Uh, wow. Okay, Monkey Men. Oh, I don't know. They're getting back up. They've lost a couple of their heads, but that seems fine. And... They're really, like, wailing on him. Wow, the Monkey Men are absolutely terrifying. That is a really creepy monkey head they've got. The super peasant is kind of, kind of taking them to school though. Blam! Wow. Okay. I feel like we need something a bit killier than than them. What about a firework watcha? Uh, maybe a couple of them. They've got to take down the super peasant. Oh! See you later, super peasant. My God. <laughs> Oh shit, okay, the Huachars have just, <gasps> just kind of killed themselves. Man, if they can just like blast him off the map. Uh oh. Okay, uh, we have one Huachar left. The Super Peasant is flying once again. Oh, you better fire fast. Uh oh. Okay, firework Huachars. They're kind of good fun actually. Uh, so we've got a guy in here called the Mirror Shield. Can one Mirror Shield stand up against a Firework Watcher? Oh my god, wow! Mirror Shield is pretty badass. Oh my god. I think the fire. uh oh. The Fireworks could kill either of them now. Blue Victory! And Mirror Shield, what else can you block? Or is this too strong for him? How good is your mirror? 
Holy fuck. Okay, right. The, the mirror shield was definitely going to make it in, so what we need to do is... Give it some cheerleaders. Let's see if how many ballistas he can take. Oh, because it kind of slows him down. Okay, but the ballista might actually just kill itself. Although, all the, the cheerleaders are working together to, like, hold it on the map. Wow, like, look at him go! Okay, that is some powerful shielding. Uh-oh. Oh, he's still going to shield up. And the blister's probably just going to knock itself off the map. Oh, good job, buddy. Uh, and... See ya, cheerleaders. He's just going to slowly... Just deal with all of that. Oh my god. What a cool guy. I, I understood that reference. Wow, okay, Mirror Shield feels pretty... pretty op. Just... Like, nothing's getting through that at all! Oh! Oh, man! Like, kind of knocked him to one side and then shot him in the back. Okay, last test. Can you do this? Oh, apparently not. The Tricker. Oh, he's like a Jester Knight. Sure. Let's have a couple of those, and they can fight Da Vinci himself. Oh my god, look at that beard. What a handsome boy. And he's got like a little, uh... Is that meant to be like an Assassin's Creed wrist blade? Also, why... Why is he so windy? Okay, sure. Um, no idea what the trickers do. Da Vinci... Uh, he's just sort of like a bit of a wild, wild kill guy. Man, he's really pulling them apart. Da Vinci, what a pro. Okay, right, we've got a real army to test things out against now. Uh, there's the whole sort of Greek Roman army turning up. And let's have a look at what some of these guys are doing. Da Vinci? Like, three Da Vinci's apparently are equal points. They've got a lot of stabbies. Like, those, all of those spears are pretty potent. And he's not really killing that many. And I feel like he's taking a lot of damage from this. But sort of just flipping around? Is he meant to be, uh, you know, Captain Assassin's Creed? There's only one Da Vinci left, and it's just all the big stabbers. Yeah, I think his days are numbered. Come on, Da Vinci. Do it for the renaissance. Oh, look, there's like a dog. Uh, come on. Oh, they're just slowly goading him towards the edge. Da Vinci, no. I don't want to take control, but I might have to. Can we win this? Can we win the day? We're kind of... Kind of getting them. Oh, we died. Shit. Student. <laughs> it's just a little jester boy with a pokey. Right, let's try some blinkers. How are they going to handle the Roman hordes? Uh, oh, that feels good. Like, instantly, they're into the back line of the, uh, like, the, the big spear formation. Oh, and they're kind of like getting behind the shields. Man, blinkers. They feel very strong. With their, like, little stabbers and just, like, teleporting around. Right, we have peasant jumpers, uh, a cloner. No idea what a cloner's gonna do. Let's just see, see how that works out. Wait, what? Uh, okay. Not really sure what's going on. Uh, okay, we're gonna have to slow-mo this down. Right, so the cloner is probably about to kill my computer. Uh, okay, he still seems to be cloning himself. That is too many units, we have to get out of here. Abort, change the map. Everything's fine. Okay, cloner, very strong. Was that the cloner 2.0? I wonder what happens if it's just the regular cloner. Okay, we've got a whole load of cloners now. And we're gonna... We're going to try and get out of this because 
Okay, we've got a medieval army. Who are they going to fight now? Uh, we do have the Dark Peasant. What is his, like, sort of gambit? Ow, he does not like being shot. He can deflect a couple of arrows. Oh, okay. The oh, God, he killed them all. Uh, if I was those archers, I'd begin to run now. This is not a good fight for them. Wow. Holy shit. Okay, what happens if he fights the super peasant? Is this a duel? A duel of the fates? We'll handle this. Kind of looks like he's just gonna push him off the map. Oh, see you later, super peasant. Maybe he's gonna be like hoisted by his own petard. <gasps> Wait a second. Super peasant wins! <laughs> wow. Look at these guys. Real old school tabs units right here. Oh. Yeah, the... The peasant hordes are not gonna take this boy down. Oh my god, look at the carnage. Them coming in column formation has definitely played right into the Super Peasant's hands. Oh, there's just one boy at the back. Should we let him have a hit? He didn't, he didn't even do any damage. Oh, Peasant. Wow, he's like big though. He's like the biggest peasant ever. Sorry, friend. Oh no, he's very close. Bam, we got him. Okay, it might just kill our computer, but let's try the cloner against them. Okay, we've got a lot of them this time. So... Right, we'll slow this down. He... they are already mass-producing. <laughs> this, like, pile of units. That is too many guys right there. Oh, you can already feel the lag. We might have to abort before this gets any slower. Even in slow motion, the frame drop is insane. Okay, we really gotta stop fiddling around with the, the cloner. Okay, so we have Monkey Man who has monkeys for hands. The monkey archers, sure. Okay, are we just doing like Planet of the Apes? Monkey throwers? Uh, let's just give them a big old line of monkey peasants up up front. Uh, and they could be fighting ancient tanks, German daggers. Great. Uh, we'll get some mirror shields on the flanks. Let's give them a firework watcher. Why not? And a ton of peasants. Sure, close enough. Right. Wow, okay. The monkey archers fire heads. Uh, that's kind of terrifying, I guess. Although the uh, deflection guy. Wow. Pretty good. Oh my god. Okay, one flank has done really well. Oh, the firework watcher is a bit more fun than the regular one, right? Like, sure, its damage isn't as good, but, like, fireworks just look amazing. See ya! Oh, he died. Wow, turns out a lot of those units, not all that great. Okay, let's get, like, a real, a real good, like, phalanx going on here. And they can have a king as well. Fuck it. Give him some healers. And a pair of knights, because that has some kind of internal logic. And I kind of just want to see uh, Firework Watch ours uh, pull, this, pull this army apart. Right. Oh, these fireworks look so cool going in. Kind of overkill. See you later, everyone. Don't come back. Get ready for the explosions. Okay, we might not be able to, uh... Be able to do this. Oh my god. Wow, this thing actually, like, really, like... Can drive around. Can I, like, just... Uh-oh, fuck. Okay. It does not turn the smoothest... 
But if I can just, like, escape... Wow, man, I just play this game. Oh, I overshot. Did I just kill my own Huachas? Shit, that's a bad... That's a bad day. Uh... Oh, that feels good. Right, gotta be careful of that lone shield, boy. Oh, we've easily got this. The king is bad, but... All of his goons... Oh, shit. Oh, like that? Is that good? Just raising my butt up a little bit. Death or glory? Oh, fuck, it's death. Wow. Although, this thing, like... Side movement is actually pretty good. Okay, this feels strong. Right, get them, boys. Shit. <laughs> okay, we've got a ton of cloners. Have you learned nothing? A ton of firework watchers versus the dark peasant. Can they thin the hordes? Wow. Wow, they actually did it. That was so many rockets as well. Okay. Uh, we need, like, a bigger horde. Maybe we get a few less of these. Where are you going? What is this? We're in the deployment phase. Okay, sure. See you later, friend. Uh, okay. Let's make this even worse. We'll have clones on both sides. Let's see how this is going to pan out. At the moment, clones kind of pretty, pretty chill. Not actually kind of... Uh-oh, wait. The dupes are coming in. If any of them survive this volley... Prepare for, for the end game. We're in the end game now. Okay, it's happening. Right, the first wave of explosives. Explosives? The first wave of explosives are going off. Okay, and now there's too many dudes. Oh, that noise is my computer breaking. Come on. And uh, I guess on this point, it's probably time to say goodbye. Uh, we'll run this. We'll run the clock down. We'll see how far we can get before this, this super explodes. Yeah, I think we might be at our limit now. Uh, I'm not even putting it in slow motion anymore. This is... This is it. This is how far we made it. Oh, someone doing something? Pow, until next time, everybody. See ya! Arf, arf, arf. I'm a dog. Uh, excuse me. <laughs> Don't use that. Uh, I'm, I'm a dog. I sure like these videos a lot. I'm a good boy, and I always put a like. Arf, arf, arf. Woof, woof, woof. Uh, anyway, I've got busy things to do, so I'll see you around. Woof, woof. Bork, bork. <laughs>